Hello, everybody, and welcome. This is Adrian. Thank you so much for joining me today. It's going to be time for some Europa Universalis 4. As the Memlux, or Arabia now, and our uh, Cradle Civilization campaign. I'm hoping to wrap up this campaign pretty damn soon. Basically, we're about to take a dear name Constantinople, hopefully, in a huge, nice battle with, uh, with Poland. Uh, let's go declare, and let's try and see if we can do this. Ooh, we're actually going to take two forts in one month. Cool. Look at that. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Oh, oh, oh. Here come the big boys. Here come the big boys. Let's see what we can do. Uh, yeah, I want to take this, eventually. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. This is like a hundred thousand Polish and Bohemian troops. I'm actually really kind of curious to see how this goes. Holy fuck. That is, a, that is quite a morale discrepancy there, buddy. We have a shit ton of cavalry too on the flanks. Look at that, his flanks just like get wrecked. Uh, three to four. Yeah, we don't roll very good. God damn it, man. We don't roll very well. Interesting. I think just for the sake of being safe, we're going to grab a couple more mercs. Lost the Siege of Macedonia, unfortunately. We'll attack here. Um, we should get a defensive bonus, as far as I know, because of straights. As far as I know. Lithuanian troops too, so. Jesus, man, this guy's running the Black Sea. Who's our best general? Yeah, 4-3. That's not bad. It's alright. We take a minus one here. Dude, holy shit, actually. That morale... That is a massive morale discrepancy. Yeah, I need that dude right there. Is there... Any policies? No. Okay, that was a pretty good battle. Yeah, we killed quite a few troops. Actually, a lot of artillerymen just died right there. Is somebody going to withdraw here? No stack wipes or anything, I don't think. Okay. So our siege ability is also really good. We have uh, 19 day siege ticks. Not bad. Can't argue with that. By the way, we have 55,000 artillery? Really? That is actually a shit done. Holy crap.
Damn. Still did not take that? Fuck. Come on, baby. Oh, really? Dude, at 57% we didn't take that. Son of a bitch. I'm trying to trap this army in here. Because if we trap those if we trap those Bohemian armies in there, I think we stack wipe them. I'm pretty sure you can't withdraw. Oh yeah, check that out right there. Let's see, Kosovo. Am I actually willing to take that fight? A little bit. Either that or we go for Arbenio right here. Yeah, actually, I'm willing to go for that. Even though we get a minus two. Oh, fuck. I thought we could defeat him before he reinforced. That's alright, though. Mm. Hmm. Yeah, him owning Crimea is actually pretty bad for us. My god, that was a good fucking battle. Look at that shit! Look at that shit! We lost 12,000 to kill... What? 40? 50, maybe? That's pretty good. Let's see. How much is Maria being occupied worth? Um, 1.5 war score. Actually, him holding, him holding Crimea is actually pretty bad for us. Yeah, we need more men. I'm running out of places to call men from. I wish we could get this, but we're not gonna get this anytime soon. Shit, that would be that'd be nice. Um Yeah, I may have to grab more mercenaries. It's five hundred each for a second twenty. Okay. Plus our, our professionalism goes down, not up. That's such- it's kind of a weird mechanic, to be honest. It's kind of strange. Yeah, actually, give me some money, dude. We're fighting a war here, I need your help. Ethiopia. Um... Yeah, this guy actually, this guy does have uh, land attrition minus 20%, so that's not bad. Um, yeah, let's see if we can come and destroy just a couple of these armies. These, these guys are really small, so most of the, most of the bulk of the force is going to be here, but... I want to see if I can just destroy a couple of these guys real quick. I know we're taking some attrition, it's bad, I know. But I want to see if I can kill a few of these guys. I wouldn't mind taking back Crimea. He's going to work on it. God damn it, these guys aren't going to let me catch them, are they? Fine, we'll just focus on Constantinople instead. Yeah, we've definitely killed more than we've lost. At least for now. Generous here's stability. I actually, I kind of want to keep stability up just because... War Exhaustion. Hmm. Yeah, but, yeah, I'm gonna lose the stability, actually. It'd probably be worse- The unrest would be worse by taking a legitimacy hit than it is by... A, uh... Oh, that looks succession already, huh? Uh, what's this guy? He's a 4-3-3? Okay. Not too shabby. Not too shabby.
I'm gonna take a minus one, but uh, we should walk all over this guy, I think. Actually, I could take this Defender of the Fate, too. That does help out, so. Might as well. I think I need all the morale I can get right now. It'd be interesting to push forward the mysticism. But I've always found just the legalism is better. Oh, really, dude? Naples took out Tunis? Holy shit, yeah, I totally forgot that that guy was in this war. Dude, that was a huge victory. Holy shit. That's pretty good. Mother of God. That is a shit ton of troops, man. God damn it, Poland. This guy moves around too much. Annoying. Dude, really? You guys did not manage to take that back? I'm actually really lucky if that's the case. Holy crap. Wow. Holy fuck, 52,000 men right there? Okay. Oh, no, he's gonna take it back. No! God damn it! Fuck you, dude! You're annoying me, man. You're annoying me. Kept on uh, admin, huh? Inflation. Might as well reduce it anyway. Fucking hell. Oh, actually, no. We still need the template, probably, probably for the mercs. <laughs> yeah. I'll take some. Uh, I'll take some loans if I have to. For now, we're doing okay. But that's that's a shit ton of men right there. That is a fuck ton. We just, we have to hold Constantinople, we just have to, have to. Tis essential. That takes so much damn attrition, though. That guy moves around troops so quickly, god damn. Damn, <laughs> we don't have manpower anyway. That's right, game. Yeah, we need more war score than this. It's not enough. Yeah, but I don't have a general. Fuck. No, we don't catch him either way. God damn it. God, dude. This is annoying as shit. I mean, if I go to one side, he fucking moves troops to the other. You know, it's just, that's the, that's the same thing he's just been doing this whole fucking time. It's actually really annoying. But we have, we have the war goal. So. I said we just keep fighting him, I guess, and we should eventually win. God damn, look at these small stacks. Yeah, let's see if we can battle him in a couple of these places. Like a few decisive, a few decisive victories here should do it. Holy shit! I guess seeing the number of troops that are here right now. Pretty gnarly. 88,000. Could- th th that's the real question, is like, could we take on an army of literally like 100,000 troops right now? Or no, this is, uh, that's like 140,000 right now. 
in comparison to what I have, like, holy shit. We need 42,000 to reinforce. So we have, like, nothing. This army's not drilled at all. <laughs> Damn. I mean, we do have, like, a tech advantage. We got a tech advantage, I think. Yeah, we have 20. Nobody, well, Bohemia's got 20, but... I don't know, maybe he'll attack me. Let's find out how this goes. Let's let's uh, let's test this out. Yeah, so he's got lack of morale. Ooh, this might do it. Ooh. Ooh. No, we're gonna lose still. God damn it! God damn it! <laughs> we did kill thirty-two thousand though, but we fucking lost just about that number, dude. Fuck. I don't even give a shit. Yeah, I want them. Give me the mercs. Give me mercenaries. I'm most positive, in fact, this guy will not attack me, but you never know, I suppose. Um. Um. God damn you, Pomeranian. I actually want to try it. Um, yeah, let's give you a shot. Sure, why not? Why not? I think we take a minus one, but we, we might be able to win. Still, he took Constantinople back, you bitch. Fuck, dude. God. He was still able to reinforce that shit. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? Fuck it, we need the mid-power anyway. God damn you, Poland. Let's see if we can go to that. Bohemia wants to... Uh, yeah, Bohemia, you want to leave? Yeah, I think so. I'll take that. I think it was honestly, it, it might have just been primarily Bohemian troops that was doing this shit. Like, I'm not actually sure Poland himself is that strong. I couldn't entirely be right. I don't know. Let's just take Constantinople and start to wrap this up. We've won most of the battles. That's why we have a positive war score. If we take Constantinople, we'll be doing even better. I have to take a Dirne as well. But let's take Constantinople and then we'll, we'll see if we can come back here for this. Yeah, here we go. I want to get one last good victory on this guy. For the sake of my honor. Such a bastard. That's right, you bastard. Fuck you, man. Where's the rest of Poland's troops? I'm good. Alright, whatever. Yeah, I'll give me those two. Is that it, right? Yeah, that's it. That's it.
Damn. It's a lot of money. Okay, so Ottomans do not exist. Now we need to core this stuff, and then we need to get our professionalism up to 100%, and then we're done. And... Yeah, it's gonna take a little bit. Holy fuck, look how much we're paying for. That's pretty gnarly. How many mercs do we have? We have 47 regiments of mercenaries. Incredible. Okay, so this professionalism will go up by 0 0.5 per year. Hiring generals gets me... We have a shit ton of military points. Um, although we don't have the general cost minus 50% anymore, which is unfortunate. Damn, actually it's a pretty good general. It's a 4-5. Not bad. So we're just going to drill and we're going to hire generals. Basically. That's just like all we're gonna do. Let's actually go and swap these. Um, drill there, and then I'll have this guy drill here. Yeah, we've got plenty of points. We don't really have a problem with points. Yeah, so basically we'll just get rid of the we'll just get rid of like the shittiest generals that we have. And just keep drilling. And let the manpower come back. Hmm. Damn. This beast ass generals, dude. Yeah, that guy's not too great. This guy was the veteran from the couple of wars that we've been fighting. Ooh, army professionalism, good. Good. Okay, cool. No need that. We have no unrest in Constantinople whatsoever. That's cool. Turkish and Sunni. All right, I'll take it. I can't complain with that. I cannot complain with that. Uh, that guy's not great. Look at this guy. Yeah, he's not great. Oh, wow, 3-6. Oh, that's not bad. Even with bad manpower recovery speed on the part of the bur of the emirs, we actually make quite a bit of manpower come back each month. Not bad. This dude, this event here, recruit from Egyptian lands, is actually really strong. <laughs> it just takes a while to build up. You have to have a good ruler to be able to get it a lot. What the fuck? Five maneuver, really? I don't really want to get rid of that guy. I don't want to get rid of this guy either. It's like, would you take a four, five, or a three, six? I would say at this stage of the game, shock is just still more important. But, well, no, actually, inventory fire is more than inventory shock, technically. The cavalry, eh, you don't do too bad, but... I don't know, that's actually kind of a hard question.
Yeah, so now we're just going to recruit generals and... Yeah, we're just going to recruit generals and get to 100, 100 professionalism. Because we already took Adirne and uh, Constantinople. All we have to do is just, yeah, have at least 100% of our professionalism. At this rate, it's going to take a little while. Okay. That was, uh... Yeah, I didn't, I didn't realize that we... <laughs> Wait, did, are these rebels? Is that why? I guess he just got the land by rebels. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Not bad. Not bad. Um, yeah, so about about these guys, who who actually would I keep? I'm thinking I would keep that guy, and I'm thinking I would keep probably that guy. I'm gonna actually probably get rid of the other two. Well, the, no, these guys are almost the same. Uh, actually, Eunice Bay would probably be the better guy to keep, because he's got two siege. Yeah, so I'd probably get rid of that guy, and then I'd probably get rid of this guy. Three maneuver, but yeah, I'd, I'd probably take a four five with two siege than I would with three maneuver. And now, recruiting generals only costs 26 military points. Damn! 362. No, nah, but that guy's just objectively better. It's kind of interesting. I, we just use this for, like, scientific purposes. Just to see, like, just how many rolls are we going to get. Yeah, so that guy's not good. That guy's not good. Okay, so we need 13 more generals. <laughs> We can get four per 100 military points. Um, these guys are crappy. Crappy. Uh, nah, still crappy. Still crappy. Look at that shit. That's crazy. I mean, then again, we only do have 26.6 armor tradition. I don't know. That's true. God, these guys are awful. See, five and one. Awful. Four, three, one, one. Yeah, it's all right. It's not like amazing. Let's see, twenty one and eight, twenty three and eight. Yeah, so, what's it coming with? 34 now. It's 29. So, wait, you need, like, 5. It's, uh, 32, right? I think. I think I got that right. Dude, shitty generals. Look at that. It's terrible.
Yeah, 26 and 8, 34. There we go. The Levantine Turnabout. Oh, did I do extra over here? I think I did. Unless two of those guys are meant for this army. Oh, I don't even know. Yeah, we did it. We have done it. Let's take a look. Limiting turnabout. As Mamluks have 100% army professionalism and annex the Ottomans. Yeah. Somebody suggested that I might want to unify Islam in this game, but uh, I really don't feel like it. Palermo, Messina, Samarkand, Ifni, Theta, and Cordoba. And all owned provinces is in Muslim religious group. Yeah, that would take forever. Well, I mean, it wouldn't take forever. It's just... I had no desire to do it, so. Anything else we could possibly do? I don't think so. Yeah, I wanted to try a different campaign. That's why I kind of wanted to wrap up this Mamluks campaign kind of early, just because I know, like, everybody would start playing the Mamluks and stuff, and we've kind of seen it all and seen everything. So, um... I don't know. Maybe, maybe we'll go for this. I don't know. Let me know. Let me know what you think about the comments below if you if you guys want to see that. We're the leading producer of coffee. Oh yeah, that's right. Former Arabian B producing coffee. We have to go to Ethiopia for that. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, we did pretty good. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. The the mine looks are OP. Um, in comparison to say the Ottomans, we're pretty OP. So, all right, guys, I will, uh, I'm going to wrap this here. Let me know if you guys want to see me do any more other achievements in this game. But I think I want to play as a different country. I want to try, like, Theodoro. I wanted to, um, I wanted to try Hissan Kaifa, which is also pretty hard. I wanted to try, like, Karaman, perhaps. So, we'll see what we can do. So, all right, guys, I will, uh, I will see you guys in the next series, in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, as always. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out Patreon if you enjoy this, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much.